Hello, Colonel fans. David Miller here alongside men's head basketball coach Jeff Neubauer. Coach, how you doing? Doing pretty well. We just got done with another practice. Uh, our guys have been very spirited here in the preseason and uh, really looking forward to play a game. Well, I'm glad to hear that, Coach. Nice to know that you know they're getting amped up, ready for this. Uh, we are going to take a quick look at some of the footage that we shot here today. All right, Mike, this is your team, right? No doubt, this is your team. Let's have a tremendous hour and a half right now. Hour and 40 is what it is. Hour 40. To TJ! I see you, Muff. I see you, Muff. Oh, get everything you can out of it today, right? Get everything you can out of this day right here. Shoot it, Jalen. Great, TJ. Glenn, how are you feeling this morning? Just good, huh? What's wrong? What's the problem? Oh, I'm listening for great. I'm trying to find great. Where's great? Get that ball and drive off the ball screen. Don't just go east-west. Don't just dribble along the arc. You want to try to get to the elbow. Get in there and attack, then pop it, and then use your fade screen. Big difference. All right. Here we go. Elbow. Great job. Your mission, your mission is to get these rebounds. Your mission is so important to our group. It's so important. You get these rebounds, we are champions. Go get a muff. Great muff. Great muff. All right. So our communication is going to another level already today, and that's what we need. All right. I like it. Whatever it is, that's the way we need to communicate nonstop every minute that we're on this basketball court. All right. So it continues. All right. We're going to shoot right now. Orlando, you're going to go with Coach Streggy's group. Our regular six guys are going to go with Coach Newt, and the three bigs are with Coach Crawford. Let's continue this communication as we get this thing going today. All right, what are we going to do? Oh, hard work, hard work on three. One, two, three. Hard work, hard work. Go. Let's get it. Let's Up the line, Corey. Up the line, Corey. Good, Jalen. Great job. Floor burner, Jalen. Jalen, good job. No middle. Nick's got the ball, and we're in a stance, and we're up the line. Good. It looks like White's on D. Looks like White's on D. All right, we're up the line. And now, if guys fire out, it's deny, deny, deny. Go ahead. Good. But if the ball gets influence, it's sprint. Do it again. Turn and sprint. Do it again. We're not, we're not going to slide. It's turn and sprint. So where are you? Deny, deny, deny. And now it's here. It's turn and sprint. All right, as hard as you can. Now. If the ball gets thrown to Josh Daniel, or if there's a back cut, snap and sprint. All right, Josh Daniel, you jack it up. We're going to hit, and we're going to rebound. All right, the energy is going to be here. All right, Timmy. Good, Timmy. Good, Timmy. Good. All right, we got that steal because Timmy Nip maybe has been watching film or whatever, but he all of a sudden got in front and said, no, I'm not allowing the ball into the post. Timmy, great job, and our white liners were there to support. All right, Coach, so you said that practice has been spirited. So overall, would you assume that everything's going very well for you so far three weeks in? That's a good question because uh, you never know exactly where you are. I do think our attitude and our perspective on things has been correct. You know, guys really want to get better. They understand that this is about the team. We don't have individuals playing for themselves. Uh, now, are we ready to beat someone? That's yet to be determined. So uh, it is early November. We are not nearly where we're going to be. But our team has approached every day with the right mentality. I'm glad to hear that, Coach. So would you say that has been what's impressed you the most so far, being such so young in the season? I think so. Also, the camaraderie among our team. Our, our team really does get along well. Uh, we've got guys who have come into our program who are brand new, who have really added a lot of energy. We have a lot of personalities, including our returners, and that's very important. So we are going to go through a long season. We are going to go through a lot of hotels and buses and uh, practice sessions, film sessions. You need to have guys with personality, and this team really does gel very well. Oh, that's awesome. That's great to hear. Be nice in the locker room, things like that. Um, coach, we have most coaches prepared differently for a season or even practice. Why don't you take us through what you do to prepare for a typical EKU practice and how you structure it? Yeah, great question. And we really have invested a lot of time in drawing up every practice. Uh, I really have given my assistant coaches a lot more responsibility this year as far as uh, them drawing up certain parts of practice. And even on certain days, they've drawn up the complete practice. But what we do is we take a look at the day's film, the, the film from the day before. 
and whatever we're not doing well the day before, that's how we figure out what we're going to work on the next day. And so we have gotten a lot of offensive ideas in. We're not really good at any of them, and we try to develop each idea every day. Defensively, we've really stressed aggressiveness. We are trying to play very aggressively. We're trying to deny the basketball. We're trying to pressure the basketball. And uh, I think we've gotten better. We've invested a lot of time in our man-to-man -man defense. Well, that's investing time in man-to-man -man is very good. When we start on Friday, be your first home game. You guys ready to get started? Well, yet to be determined. Uh, I think our team, they really want to be ready. You know, they, they've got the right mentality about it. Um, However, there's so much that we're not, you know, we're just not prepared for here early in the season. So there are things in January and February where we've been through games, we've been through game-like situations. We'll be ready for those scenarios. But here early in the season, there are things that could pop up that we just haven't seen in practice yet. We do everything we can as a coaching staff to prepare for every possible situation, but there will be things that could surprise us. Uh, I am expecting our team to play very hard, and uh, I look forward to them playing one, as one unit. They are, they are a team. All right, Colonel fans, just want to remind you guys that the season tips off at 7.30 this Friday at McBrayer Arena, where our Colonels take on Cincinnati Christian. Admission is free, but everybody is encouraged to bring toiletries for the Madison Day of Hope event. Coach, I want to thank you for taking time with us today. I know you got a busy schedule right now, so we'll let you get back to it. Well, we have enjoyed fall break. We've gotten a lot out of our team here over these extra couple days where we haven't had class, and uh, our guys are looking forward to competing on Friday night. Thanks a lot, Coach. Have a great year. Thanks, Dave.